snow day, but more like a freezing rain day. Why? Because that's all ice pellets. Why? Let's see if cookies as well and that's what yeah, we're going to try mixed today. Yeah, with the cookies. And it's I have gluten-free pumpkin spice loaf and muffins. Pumpkin like spice loaf with a muffin. Um, the caramel sauce goes with the caramel gingerbread. Caramel sauce. And gluten-free pancake uh, bagel and waffle mix. And I got one of their um, bagel pans to try out. And it actually comes with... Uh, some recipe ideas in it too. So I don't know if we're gonna make pan uh, pancakes bagels today or if we're just going to try the cookies, um, but this is what we're gonna use, the Epicure gingerbread gluten, gluten-free gingerbread mix. So it is day three of Vlogmas and I've been making my videos and still kind of hemming and hawing whether I wanted to do this or not, but, um, I decided today I would go ahead with it and I got out my MacBook which I haven't opened in probably almost a year and I had almost 5,000 emails on it as well as it needed an update um, on the iOS so I have spent the morning clearing out my email and now I'm doing an update which is still 23 minutes away from being finished. So I'm not sure if Vlogmas is going to happen yet or not, but we're gonna give it a go and I'll keep um, videotaping and see if I can get things up and running. So I thought while I was waiting um, for my system to update that I would add the pom-pom to my Hamantech that's how you pronounce it, uh, patterned by So Very Shannon, Shannon Cook. Um, I started this with the last snow day, which was on Thursday. Today is uh, Tuesday, and we have another snow day. So I actually finished this in the one day, but I wanted to add a pom-pom to it that I have. So I'm going to stitch this on. I'm not going to block it because I just like how they feel um, tight against my head whenever I finish knitting them. Um, so I'm going to keep that just the way it is, add the pom-pom and it will be finished. And I'm still sipping on my David's tea from this morning. I really like this. Um
and I'm watching some vlogs as well. I do all of this at the same time. the first time that I've sewn on um, a faux fur palm. I'm not crazy about how much it wobbles. It has um, yarn strings attached to it and I put a yarn string on either side of the hole in the middle and um, tied it a couple of times before I wove it all in. But there's nothing else really to keep it from flopping around. I mean I'm not going to be bobbling my head around like this all the time but I don't know. It just doesn't seem as secure as a, a, a knit pom pom would. So there's my hat. So this is my Skolfig Y'all sweater. I don't know if I pronounced that anywhere correctly. Um, by Diana Walla. And I knit it uh, a couple of years ago now, 2017. And I just knit it in the exact same colors um, that she did in the pattern because I loved it exactly as it was. So it's my little forest of trees. It's a little uh, more oversized than what I would normally knit. Um, so I tend to wear it just around the house and in the winter, and when I go out snowshoeing, it's not really one that I um, wear out because it's it's really baggy, but I still love it. Did you have a nice sleep? Did you have a nice sleep? Yeah. 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 Can dad hear yet? Mm. Can I take a picture of you? So I've been doing some knitting on my sleeve while I wait for my uh, computer to install the new downloads that needed to be downloaded on it. And we have been about three minutes remaining for about 45 minutes. So I'm thinking I'm either frozen or it's just gonna take a really long time. But my goodness, my screen is filthy. You can tell I haven't used it in a while. <laughs>